Hello friends, how are you all? This is Jin Island School and today we will learn um, one of the most important topic of genetic engineering and biotechnology and that is agrobacterium mediated gene transfer. That means the how genes are transferred from one organism to other organism via agrobacterium tumefaciens bacterium vector. So I hope you will share this video to your friends so that everybody can learn the basic genetic engineering. So come to the point. First we have to know what is agrobacterium mediated gene transfer. Agrobacterium is a one type of gram negative bacteria that found in the soil so and that cause crown gall disease in plant. Here is the picture. That is the crown gall disease. So, crown gall disease is a tumor forming element. So, that is a tumor form. We know that from a tumor, cancer are produced. So, agrobacterium tumefaciens are the main element to cause the crown gall disease in a plant. So, now we will learn how this crown gall disease are form in the bacteria cell a vector are found that means this type of vector here this is a vector that means ti plasmid in the agrobacterium tumefaciens bacterium these vector are found and this TI plasmid that means tumor inducing plasmid this is the main capable to produce crown gall disease so TI plasmid can also be used to transport new gene from one organism to other organism for that reason agrobacterium mediated gene transfer use the TI plasmid or agrobacterium bacterium agrobacterium bacteria or agrobacterium tumefaciens bacteria so think in a bacterium we know in bacterium chromosome there is a chromosome uh, in bacterium this vector are found and I, re I said that that is called TI plasmid cause that is tumor inducing now we will learn the mechanism of that is the mechanism of, of crown gall disease here you see that I said that crown agrobacterium tumefaciens is found in the soil and that is the plant normal plant and in the agrobacterium this is the agrobacterium bacteria that is the chromosome and that is the TI plasmid and it is the tDNA in the next step we will learn about TI, tDNA part so now, now that is chromosome and that is the TI plasmid so in the tDNA part that is the main part to cause the tumor or, or crown gold disease so tDNA is the main affecting part tDNA is 15 to 30 kilo base pair in size among the stains so some, we know that uh, some stains are found in agrobacterium tumefaciens when the tDNA is transferred to the plant cell that is the chromosomal DNA and the tDNA transferred to the plant chromosome here you see that and then the plant produces the crown gall disease that is the mechanism so in this mechanism we will transfer our gene particular gene to our record new organism so how that is produced now we will learn about the tdna and the details about ti plasmid that is the ti plasmid and here you see that that is the tdna region i said that tdna is transferred to one organism to other organism in the tdna few components are found that, that is the virulence region this this region contains the gene required for tDNA transfer process 
to transfer this tdna to our new organism so we need the required gene that are found in the bullous region the genes in the region encode dna processing enzyme required for excision transfer or integration of the tdna segment that means in the bullous region the dna processing enzymes like we know the uh, dna repairing mechanism mechanism that the excision mechanism the transfer mechanism or integration of tdna segment all are happens by the presence of gene in the virulence region so here is the left border and see that at the right border this is the two border of the tdna region so we can cut from that this two side and we will cut the tdna region then we will attach our required gene at us here and that will transfer so what is uh, what is contains in this region that is auxin cytokinin opine we know that the auxins are uh, hormones and cytokinins are hormones that required in tdna region here is it another component that is opine in this mechanism opine is used as the nutrient for the bacteria I repeat, opine is used as the nutrient of the bacterium and cytokinin auxin are hormones for this bacterium and this is the border, two borders where we will cut the tDNA region. As I said that about the bullous region, bullous region contains the genes to cut these uh, two borders. And here is the final process of agrobacterium mediated gene transfer. We have learned about all of the component and about the tDNA, TA plasmid, agrobacterium tumefaciens, the crown gold disease, etc. Now we will learn about the main mechanism of agrobacterium tumefaciens. Here is it is agrobacterium tumefaciens. I said that this is the chromosome and that is the TI plasmid. And here it is TI plasmid and that is the tDNA region. So I said that. The tDNA region is cut down and new or required gene is attached here. So by restriction enzyme, this is cut out and our required gene or gene of interest, gene of or gene for desired trait is insert to this region. Here is so so new genes are attached here. So now this is a recombinant TI plasmid. Because a recombination is occurred here in the TI plasmid region, and that is our desired trait. We cut the original TI plasmid region, TFT DNA region, and that is our required trait gene here. When introduced to this plant cell in culture, in culture we, with that we introduce in the plant cell this region. This so tDNA carrying new gene within plant chromosome. In the plant chromosome, which we say, we say, we see that the new genes are carrying by the tDNA region. So here is TI plasmid. We know the plasmid is just a carrier, carrier of gene. So by the this TI plasmid, we we got a new gene and we used the TI plasmid as a carrier to transfer the gene to our plant that is the plant cell you see that, that in the chromosome new genes are here in the colored region so after regeneration of plant when the plant is go to the next generation then the plant produce with new trait so our gene of interest is transferred by the chromosome to the new plant that is the whole process of agrobacterium mediated gene transfer. By agrobacterium, we use the tDNA region to attach our gene of interest, and that is recombinant TI plasmid. And that this recombinant TI plasmid it attached to our plant, and then the plant is uh, produced with a new trait. So, friends, I hope that everybody easily now can understand what is the agrobacterium mediated gene transfer 
Thanks for watching my video. If you like my video, sub subscribe my channel, like my video and comment what you want to know and if I have any problems or if I have said any wrong, then comment me. I will uh, recorrect my lesson and I hope that everybody will understand that so easily. So, goodbye friends. Thanks.